Deciding the best teams in history is never easy, but we thrive on making the tough decisions. So, each armed with our personal favorites, we gathered in a darkened room one evening to narrow things down. Deliberations continued long into the night. In between the bickering, name-calling and hair-pulling, one thing became apparent this list had to be about more than just cold, bare trophy halls. Football is also about intangibles, how cool a team is, what effect they have on future generations, their aura. You won't find too many, one-season wonders in this list, but there's room for a special few. Read on to see who we mean. Without wasting much time here are the greatest, and most entertaining football clubs of all time. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bell for more updates. 1. Ajax 1965-73 Coach Rhinus Michels, the club's trademark for 3, 3, chaotic position switching, and teamwork was established, total football invented. When he left in 1971, replacement Stefan Kovacs afforded the team yet more attacking freedom. Drifting center, forward Johan Cruyff was the undoubted star, conducting his orchestra with typical pomp. Johan Niskens provided midfield, legs, Ari Hahn and Jerry Murin the tactical discipline, center, back Veliber Vazovic the Yugoslav steel. Over 40 years since their pinnacle a 1-0 win, against Juventus to secure the 1973 European Cup, their third in a row Ajax is 4-3-3 remains football's most flexible formation. But it's the way they made you feel the long hair, rock star, swagger and beautiful play that sets them apart. 2. Brazil 1970 Brazil had had good sides before, but the team that swaggered to glory in 1970 will forever occupy a prominent place in the pantheon. This side represented the romantic ideal of football, the entertaining epitome of you score four, we'll score five. After being hoofed out of the 1966 tournament, Pele was at his peak in a team of showstoppers. Alongside him up top was Tostal, with Roberto Rivellino and Torrezinho providing the ammunition from the flanks. Yes, the team, had flaws. The back half wasn't great, conceding against everyone but England. Yet even holding midfielder Claude Olga dribbled past four Italians, during a final that's etched into legend as representing Jogo, Benito, the beautiful game, prioritizing inventive, attack over canny defense. 3. AC Milan 1987-91 Italy's most successful European campaigners have enjoyed several stellar vintages, but the perfect storm of style and success came in a four-year flurry that blew away Italy's boring football reputation. Playing a total football ting, high-pressing 4-4-2, Arrigo Sacchi's side which featured Dutch trio Ruud Gullit, Marco, Van Basten, and Frank Ricard, with Franco Baresi and Paolo Maldini minding the shop in defence dominated opponents physically and tactically. In the 1988-89 European Cup they humiliated Real Madrid 5-0 in the semi-final second, legged, and Stoa Bucharest 4-0 in the final. Some argue the team who retained the trophy in 1990, letting in just three goals, was even more cultured. 4. Real Madrid 1955-60 the influence of this team extends far beyond the talent of Di Stefano, Ferenc Puskas, Raymond Coppa and Peco Gento. Far beyond even the trophies they accumulated, and no other team, has won five European Cups in a row, as they did, from 1956 to 1960. This team, Alex Ferguson said once, invented the idea of a modern football club, signing the best players regardless of nationality, becoming synonymous with a particular style of football, and seizing the opportunity provided by the new European Cup to create a global brand. The tawdry magnificence of the Galactico era can be traced back to this polyglot side. This Madrid side, as Santiago Bernabéu said of Di Stefano, smelled of good football. 5. Barcelona 2008-11 In 50 years' time, when most of us will be eating through a straw, we can die happy that we saw one of the greatest sides ever performing at the apogee of their celestial talent. In introducing Tiki Taka originally intended as an insult to the footballing lexicon, Barca Ray wrote the beautiful game's playbook in their own, perfectly formed 4-3-3 image. Winning an unprecedented sex pupil in his first season, Pep Guardiola achieved nirvana by moving Lionel Messi in field. The 3-1 victory against Manchester United in the 2011 Champions League final, no one has given us a hiding like that admitted, Alex Ferguson merely confirmed what Real Madrid legend Jorge Valdano calls a miracle generation.